If you've ever heard the term WordPress, then most likely you've had some kind of conversation about building your own website or your own blog. And WordPress usually comes highly recommended by most people who use it. And so this is going to be the first video on a series that's going to go through the essential information or an introduction to how to use WordPress to create your own website. Throughout this series, we're going to start out here at the beginning, and we're going to go through and create a website from scratch and teach you a lot about the ins and outs of WordPress and how to get started with your own website or your own blog that you want to get going with. And so there's a couple of things about WordPress that make it so wonderful. It's always good to see something that's free. And if you take a look right there, I've got it highlighted here on the WordPress's website, which is wordpress.org. You'll see it says free, and it is free. It's also open source, which means the coding that's going into building WordPress itself is open, and a lot of programmers can look at it and they make continual improvements to this thing to make it the wonderful application that it is. And so that's another thing. WordPress also allows you, if you're looking at developing your own website and you're not very familiar with some of the programming languages like HTML or JavaScript or PHP that are out there for developing websites, you don't have to worry because WordPress is an amazing package that can take somebody with very little to no knowledge of building a website and create a very advanced and very wonderful looking website. And by wonderful looking, they also have themes for those people out there that do not have any graphical ability as far as creativity is concerned and creating something that looks nice. You don't have to have that because there's themes out there or basically templates that look wonderful as far as putting your whole website together. And so within a matter of minutes, you can have yourself a site that, that's up and running and then you're going to continually make updates too. And so this whole series is going to go through and learn the ins and outs and talk about how to create a site and how to do some of the things within WordPress itself. If you click on the download tab within the website itself, you'll go to the download page. Now, I'm not going to be downloading it for this series. We're going to do this all online. And so if you want to download it and set it up on your own web server, if you're familiar with the web server, you can definitely download it here. The zip file is going to be for those Windows users out there, the tar file right here is going to be for those Linux or um, Unix users out there. And so depending on what you want to work with, we're not going to be installing this within our series. We're going to actually do everything from the web itself so you don't have to worry about downloading anything. However, if you have your own web host or your own website that you're running from your own computer, definitely do this yourself. You're going to have more, more features and we're going to talk about that here in the next video.